Hey, what's up? This is Luke from Profit Boosters and in this short video, you will see the best face swap video app that you can use easily and fast. Besides the video face swapping feature, this app does more, like face swap pictures and swapping the background of pictures and videos. This way you can create new media, and profit from them. 2-3 years ago such tools were more like a conspiracy theory, and now you can have one of these face swap apps on your own. This software's results are excellent, as you will see in this video. This gives you numerous opportunities of making additional income on autopilot, so make sure you watch this video to the end. And if you like such content please make sure to subscribe, and hit the bell icon, so you don't miss anything. Let's check it out. Hello everyone, it's Todd Gross, and in this video I am going to show you a demonstration of one of the most exciting, fun pieces of software ever on the planet to use and to actually get real meaningful results with, and that of course is FaceSwap. And what I'm going to do is show you three key features inside FaceSwap. There's more features than that, but this is going to just give a real idea of how well it works and just how easy it is to use. So the first thing I'm going to tackle is an image face swap that would be over here on the right when I log in. And basically you get thrown into the image face swap area. On the left hand side is where you're going to drag and drop or browse to find the actual image that's your original image. So I'm going to do that right now. Another way to actually get to this area would be from the drop down menus on the top of the screen. This would be the face swap tab. Um, and then you'd go down to image face swap. So we're in the same exact spot. So I'm going to browse for the image. I'm going to go to a folder. Let's see if I could find my folder. And there it is for demonstration purposes. Um, it is going to be the original here. Okay, so we're going to wait for just a moment and the original is going to come up in front of us. And then we're going to change the face of this image. And I'm going to show you how you could target for an exact age group, an exact... You can even change gender if you wanted, but you could change the uh, ethnicity so that you have actually multiple faces. Now, it has just co been called up. You can see the face right now is a young white um, male. And what we're going to do is actually try to change this into an Asian male. So again, for targeting, I mean, that's just huge that you could change an image from one thing to another and it's going to work really well because I have to tell you, I already tried it on this particular image. It's already in there and I know how it's going to come out. I'm excited to show you. So the next thing you do is you have a database of images. Now you could either use that, the images that are already in the database, or you could use the My Faces tab, in which case you can actually bring in your own images, your own faces to swap with. And then the actual faces that you use get stored over here on the left where it says used faces. But in this case, we're going to use the database. And uh, in my notes, it said to go to the third page after I filter it down. So let me filter it by this. I'm going to click here. And uh, it's a little hard to see here, but gender is male. And here the age group is adult. And the region is, we're looking for Asian. So we're going to go to the third page. Two, three, no, that's not it. Four, there it is. It's the fourth image, a uh, fourth page, center image. It's this one right here that I chose. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on that and notice that that image now is up here. So we have the original on the left and then we have the new face on the right. And these faces, my friends, are going to merge. Now, there's different ways to do it. The one that we find the best is to use what's called light mode. That's a light rendering which changes the face about half and half, about 50% of the way there from one face to another. So it's almost like a direct blend of the first and the second. Deep mode, we've had varying success with. Sometimes it works really well and changes the face oh, maybe 80% of the way towards the new face. Other times, especially using videos, it doesn't work quite as well. So it's more hit or miss. And then we have HD or Super HD. In this case, I guess we'll do uh, Super HD since I put a Super HD image in there to begin with. And from there, what we're going to do is we're going to just give it a title. White male black jacket with... Asian male page four bottom 
just so that I know where we're getting it from, even though that face is going to be saved. Okay, and then all you have to do is just click render, and that is it. What's going? To, oh, actually, we're going to render in light mode. Okay, so we're going to render it. We're going to click render, and then just press OK at that point. It says you'll be charged a credit. Um, and then, as you can see from looking at this right here, these are the ones we've been working on. Um, and earlier, I did indeed do the same thing that I did just now. And I'm going to be able to download that right here. So I'm going to download it. Just click on that right there. Save the file. Or actually, I'll open it. Hopefully, it'll open right in front of us here. And here it is. And take a look at that remarkable difference. I'll show you both images. There's the changed image. And now let me show you the original image. And here's the original. Do you see what I mean? It's it's a perfect rendition of the new face. So if you had an application where you wanted to appeal to a completely different uh, targeting, a targeted group, all of a sudden you've gone from white male to Asian male and it's perfect. Okay, and as I look right now, it only took two minutes for it to actually render. Sometimes it takes longer. Sometimes it takes upwards of 15 minutes for these things to render. But this image rendered in just two minutes, and it is ready. This is identical to the one I did last night when I was testing this out. So anyway, the next thing I want to do is show you how to swap out a background. And that, we would go to the tab right here, a face swap tab. And now we're going to do a remove video background because I'm going to get a little fancy here and actually pick a video rather than just a still image. I'm going to browse again. And this time I'm going to take um, a video I actually shot on my iPhone. And I did this just a couple of days ago before I'm recording this. And um, it's, a, it's a clear video in front of a lake and I wanted to switch out the background. So let's say this is actually a video. It's not a still image. Um, so let me just put a title in first. I'm going to write um, Todd video swap background to Arches National Park. Okay, so I actually did once go to Arches National Park and stood in front of Delicate Arch, one of the most famous arches in the world. And I want to, I actually did a video from there. Um, I don't have it in front of me, but I'm going to recreate my delight of doing a video in front of Arches National Park by actually selecting that. Now, how do I do that? Well, I have to go into my images and find the arch. So here's the arch that I uploaded. I actually had uploaded the arch. That's it's located here on the right. Do you see it right there? So I'm uploading. So I actually uploaded that already. The way I did that was I just clicked upload file. You see the button upload file right there? Okay, so it's pre-uploaded. And uh, there's delicate arch. So I'm now selecting that. All right, so I now that it's highlighted, we're all set because we put the title in, we put the arch image in, that's all selected, and now all we have to do is just click render. And the background will actually be recognized, and this background you see right here will change. If we go two down, you'll see I did this yesterday, and indeed I'm in front of the arch. Let's see how it looks. We'll download it. Hey, it's Todd Gross. Have you heard about FaceSwap? It's that amazing deep fake software that Oliver Goodwin and I are. So there you go. That is a look at how to change out a background. Now, the next thing I want to do is I want to change the face of an actual video. Now, that's impressive, right? Uh, let's do that. Let's actually change um, ethnicity again. This time, let's pick a video face swap rather than an image face swap. And we're going to browse for our video, and we're going to take this um, blonde woman. This is the original right here. You're going to see it come up in just a moment. And here she is. So now, again, we could either render in deep or light. Since it's a video, we definitely want to try light. Uh, the deep mode is really in beta test still, um, and it's just something to play with that you know, we wanted to give you the option to play with because in some circumstances you could really <laughs> make the person look a lot like the one that you're putting in with the deep mode. Okay, now this time the face I'm going to swap in 
is going to be Latino. Uh, so we're going to go female. And again, this is on the right-hand side. I get it to choose adult and the region is Latino. And on the right-hand side, this is the face I chose last night. Notice it's now pushed to the top, right next to the face of the original. And then I'm going to render this in light mode and HD and make sure I have a title in there. Uh, white, female, and Latino, page one. And then from there, I am going to just click render in light mode. Okay, here's the result. And as you could see, we now have changed the ethnicity of the model. She certainly maintains that look throughout the video. So that is just incredible. By the way, my best results have been with Google Chrome. So use that browser. Um, you can see that they do get ready pretty fast. The rendering, for instance, for this last one, uh, that I also did last night, so we we're able to see it right away, just a, another minute before that is ready right now. As I said, usually it takes from a few minutes to as much as 15 minutes, occasionally higher when the demand is really high on the system. Still, fast results, easy to use, face swap is a winner, especially when it comes to ease of use. As you can see, the software is really easy and fast, and the results are great. It gives you numerous possibilities and opportunities for additional passive income strings. This is the best face swap app, especially when you compare value to the investment. To get more information, simply click the link below this video in the description. Also, if you get this face swap app using my link, you will get 8 bonuses, allowing you to profit from face swapping immediately. Check out the special bonuses listed below, which you get 100% for free. If you're watching this video on YouTube, the link is in the description. Thank you for watching and I'll see you at the next one. Make sure to click the link below to see the bonuses, and start making additional money, on autopilot, this week. Check everything below and I'll see you in another video. Cheers! Replace face in the video app, click the link below, to get it, before the price goes up.